Okay, here is the uh, part two, two of my Planet of the Apes uh, makeup uh, casting. Um, the video is coming up in just a moment, but before it does, remember to like, share, and subscribe to my channel. I want to monetize this channel eventually, and um, the more people I get watching it, more likely I can actually make a dime or two off of this. Um, so, be sure you punch the little um, bell down there after you subscribe so that you get notifications when the new videos come up. I am sharing these currently on my Facebook channels, but uh, will eventually not do it because I want people to come here to YouTube rather than going directly to my Facebook channels. So, here you go. Okay, okay. Uh, what you're looking at right now is I laid the piece down in my my little handy tray here. And um, like a lot of the pieces when you do this thing, see, uh, it's not level. So I have some water-based clay, which I made a shroud for to sit in so it would stay level. And that there the, um, wouldn't get any plaster creep under the mold. That's always a problem. And um, the first layer, oh, before I mention that, the, the clay I use for sculpting is an oil-based clay. I get it from uh, Monsters Clay. Actually, it's called Monster Clay. And I, I can get it through MakeupStore.com, where I buy a lot of my stuff. They're great people. I'll have a link for link to them in the comments. But here's the clay itself. Monster clay. It's a sulfur-free, oil-based, elastic clay. And the advantage of sulfur-free is, is that uh, uh, you can use silicone. Uh, regular uh, sulfur clay is a problem with silicone. It doesn't like it. So, well, anyway... The uh, first layer of plaster is in, and it's probably going to take about five minutes before I put the second layer on. First layer I brushed on, oh, well, first before I did that, I did lay down a perimeter of uh, Vaseline and then sprayed this with uh, cooking spray. Uh, it's an off-brand. That's the stuff I use. I get it at Aldi. It's wonderful stuff. And... Um, so I laid down the first uh, layer of plaster with a brush. Second layer is going to be a little thicker, and it won't be a brush. So we'll have more to come. Bye for now. Next, there is a layer, two layers of regular clay, excuse me, regular plaster over top of the um, first thin coat that I put on for detailing. Then I put uh, two layers of plaster-soaked bandages to give it strength. Now there's going to be a, a beauty coat to uh, lock it all down and to seal it up. And in about a half an hour, 45 minutes at minimum, I can flip it over and pull everything out. But I'll probably let it sit most of the day just to make sure it's all cured. And because i got something else going on this afternoon. Okay, final look as it's drying. Put a nice layer of plaster over top of everything. And uh, especially trying to reinforce down here because that's a weak spot. And hopefully uh, about an hour or two when I pull this off, it is going to look great. 